Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. And today, I've got this week's F1 updates. Frankly, there isn't much to go over this week. Well, not as much as last week anyway. But the stuff that we do have from this week is pretty important, actually. So we've had two things announced. One, a new livery for the F1 22 video game, which I'll come to in a moment. And we've had the announcement of the six tracks that will host the six sprint races next season. But... I'm going to talk about the F1 livery first, because it's actually really interesting. Um, I'm sure we all remember the day that Audi announced they were entering F1 earlier last season, 20, the 2022 season, and they unveiled, like, an F1 22 generation car with a mock Audi livery. That mock livery is now in the game. So... Really, if you tried hard enough, you could create an Audi F1 team. Probably with some mods, like you could probably make a full-blown Audi team. They may be able to... I don't know how much they've added in terms of branding. You may be able to stick the Audi logo on your race suit. I don't know. But frankly, that's really cool. The fact that they've added this mock livery into the game so you can have an 11th official F1 team. God. Imagine an F1 game having more official teams than real life. Ouch. But let's talk about the big news from today, and that is the six sprint race tracks for the 2023 season. And they are as followed, I believe, in the order in which they're actually happening. So we start off with Azerbaijan, which is going to be the Baku circuit, which, OK, that could be interesting. Austria. Okay, not bad. Belgium. Okay, now this one has me scratching my head a little bit. Because as we know, sprint races are only 100 kilometers long. And uh, Spa-Francochamp is the longest track on the calendar. So that's not going to be many laps. I reckon <laughs> 10 at most, uh, roughly. Then we have Qatar. Okay, interesting. Then we have Texas. All right, that one could be good. And Brazil, which I do think could also be a really good one. And I think that was actually one of the ones that we had this year. Yeah, but honestly, those six, I mean, okay. I'm willing to give them all a go. Although I have a strange feeling some of them won't work. Namely, Azerbaijan and Belgium. I don't think those are going to go very well, because, of course, that castle section is going to make things very, very tricky. Because, of course, we have two races that weekend, so that means that there's going to be a lot of vying for position in that sprint race. That could get messy. And the Belgium one, uh, that isn't going to be many laps. I've got to be honest. That I, I think that'll be maybe 10. Maybe 10 laps because of how big the track is. I'm not sure, but honestly, again, as I said, I'm willing to give them all a go, but I'm sceptical on a few of them. But yeah, I'm actually afraid that's it for this week's F1 update. Like I said, there hasn't been much to go over this week. But yeah, that's going to do it for this video, guys. So please, like this video, subscribe to my Nox Signs and Frost YouTube channels. Their links are in the description, as always. My sub button is going to be down there. Yeah, that big red one. Unless you've already subbed, then it's going to be grey. Thanks for that, by the way. And once you have done that, please don't forget to click all three of the bell icons to get all three sets of our notifications. Comment as well, because why the heck not? And let me know what you think of the Audi livery in F122 and what you think of these six sprint race locations. And if you're sceptical on any of them like I am, once you've done that too, please follow me on all my social medias. They're going to be in the link tree in the description Below that will be Roxanne's website and Frost's Instagram. And lastly, of course, please, please, please do share this video with all of your friends so they can join the infinite loop of liking, subscribing, commenting, following, and sharing. And round and round and round that loop. I'll see you guys tomorrow with another video. Goodbye. <laughs>